Hi guys, welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. Today we're going to make a moisturizer. A quick and easy DIY moisturizer using rice. Rice can help to tighten and firm and reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. Rice water is widely used in skincare products because it is so good for the skin. Not only is it good for the skin, but it's also good for your hair, your nails. So if you're looking for a DIY moisturizer, use it just a simple ingredient. Follow me to the kitchen and I'm going to share the full detail recipe and I'm also going to share some tips on how to get the best result from using this on your skin. So to make this anti-aging moisturizer, I am going to be using some white rice. Rice is rich in antioxidant. Antioxidant that can reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the face, the neck and decollete. So what I'm going to do with the rice, I am going to be boiling the rice. So reach for a saucepan and pour about one cup of water in the saucepan. Leave it on the stove top to come to a boil. While this is going on, reach for your rice and we want to wash the rice. When we wash the rice, we are making sure that it is clean enough for the face. So we are going to use half a cup of rice and we're going to add this rice to the pot. What we're going to be doing is boiling the rice to extract the antioxidant. We're not going to overcook the rice. We're basically like blanching the rice, just releasing the antioxidant, such as vitamins and minerals from the rice. Next, I'm going to reach for some orange peel powder. This I'm using as a vitamin C. Vitamin C is a sorbic acid. To dry your orange peel, simple peel and to dry for about a week or two and blend. I'm going to be using about a teaspoon of the orange peel powder. I'm adding this to the saucepan with the rice and I'm going to stir and we're leaving this on the stove top for about another two minutes or so. Now, once this is done, we are going to reach for some milk powder, also known as powdered milk. This is rich in lactic acid. This is also rich in exfoliating properties. This is rich in antioxidant, vitamin B, C. This is going to help to tighten and firm and reduce wrinkles on the skin. I'm using two tablespoons of the milk powder. If you do not have milk powder, you can go ahead and you can use regular milk or soy milk in this recipe. And now we are going to stir and we are going to stir. you got to keep stirring at this stage because the milk is going to boil and foam up and you don't want it to boil over nor do you want it to dry out. So just keep stirring to a creamy consistency. This is the base for our anti-aging moisturizer. And take a look at this. Look how creamy this is. Now we are going to strain. And you want to strain this while it is still very much warm. Because once it gets cold, it's going to get thicker. And you do not want that. Work with it while it is warm. So go ahead and strain. This moisturizer is rich in skin firming properties, vitamin A, rich in skin brightening properties, vitamin C, rich in antioxidant, vitamin E. This also contains some omega-3, lactic acid, and ascorbic acid. And now that this is done, we're going to reach for some oils. And we're going to pour these oils while it is still very warm. So I'm going to use some rosehip seed oil. And this oil is rich in a vitamin A, vitamin C, and vitamin E. I call this oil a perfect anti-aging oil. Next, I'm going to reach for some avocado oil. Another of my favorite oil to use on the skin. This one also is rich in vitamin A, vitamin C, omega-3. It also contains all the electrolytes. It helps a lot that moisture in the skin. I'm using one teaspoon of the avocado oil. Now I'm reaching for some papaya seed oil. Another one of my favorite oil to use on the skin. Papaya also contains vitamin A, vitamin C, and vitamin E. This is making this rice cream moisturizer a very, very strong anti-aging moisturizer. That's going to reduce wrinkles and fine lines, lift, tighten, and firm the skin. I'm going to also use some aloe vera in the 
as aloe vera gel, which also help to nourish and protect the skin, which is antibacterial properties, so it keep acne at a bay. And also good for sun damaged skin. One teaspoon of the avocado. One teaspoon of the aloe vera gel, and we're mixing this in. At this stage, you can choose to pour this back in a blender and blend, or you can choose to just whisk a little more and then pour in your storage jar. I'm going to pour mine in a small glass jar. Make sure that your jar is sterilized before you pour. Just put it in some hot water and boil. And now, my anti aging rice cream is ready you're gonna set it aside to cool and then you're gonna use it on your face this you can store in the refrigerator for up to seven days all you need from this is two to three drops and clean a skin so I'm gonna do a live demonstration here for you I'm taking about the two to three drops right here in my hands and I am gonna just rub it in my hands and then I'm just gonna press it on my skin you're gonna use this right after your serum so go ahead spritz on your toner your serum and then grab this moisturizer note that I'm using it also on my neck and decollete since this is a skin tightening skin firming moisturizer apply it on the skin and this is also safe to go under your eyes use it a.m. and p.m. and give it time to work give it at least a four to six week guys you're gonna see amazing results thank you so much for watching don't forget store it in your refrigerator and when this is done guys go ahead and make a new batch and there you have it thank you all for watching you like the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to share and don't forget to leave your comments Thank you.